Friends, our Lenten journey began with the words of the prophet Joel, come back to me with all your heart. Our Lenten invitation is indeed a journey back to the merciful Father to experience his embrace. Jesus taught us this when he taught us how to pray. The Lord's Prayer, as we know it, is both a personal and a communal prayer. It is to God and with others. Remember how it begins. Our Father. The hour is a prayer with others, even when we might be alone. And Father, a name of intimate embrace, of respect and warmth. It's a prayer full of both praise and petition. In a sense, the Lord's Prayer is a prayer of little prayers put together. It does not begin with asking. It begins with acknowledging. It shows us God and who God is for us. Your name be holy, your kingdom come, your will be done. It's about our yearning for God. Then there are the petitions. Give us the food we need. Forgive us as we are to forgive. Don't put us to the test. Deliver us from the evil one. The central one in all of that is the petition of forgiveness. To forgive or to be forgiven goes to the heart of the mission of Jesus, to what he came to do for us. God's forgiveness in Jesus is on the cross, his death for us. From the cross comes our recreation in forgiveness. So to be forgiven from there, the cross, and to forgive from there is the heart of the gospel we proclaim. So praying our way through Lent this year Returning to God our Father is a beautiful way in which we participate in our faith.